Hit the thumbs up and bust backwards. <laughs> All right, here we go, kids. Are you excited? I know I am. Fears of Fathom, episode three, Carlson House, step 24. Straight into it. Texas speed running. My name is Noah. I'm a 28 year old male from the Midwest. Press any key. I have no idea why I'm sending this, but I hope my story can be a lesson. Ah, uh, that's right. These are all things that were sent in to like Reddit. These games are based off Reddit stories and my voice is breaking already, kids. It's a tragedy. This happened to me when I was 18. But I remember this incident like yesterday as the trauma dictated a major part of my life. For a little background, my dad was a realtor and almost always became friends with his clients. Really? One day he came home and pitched me a small job offer for the weekend. One of his old clients was going away for a few days and needed somebody he could trust to watch over his house. Man worked as a COO at a local media company. Dad told me the man would pay me 100 just to watch the house and do some basic chores. I accepted the offer as I had nothing interesting going for the weekend. Besides, I thought I could use the time to get my schoolwork done. Oh, what a nerd. Plus, I wasn't picky where my pocket money came from. My dad drove me to the house. What was that? Is this house a laundromat? What is this? Can I play this? No, I cannot. Who's that? I'm confused. What is going on? I can't open anything. What? I'm stuck. What the hell just happened then? Can I leave? No. I got the game up so loud, kids. Jesus Christ, help me. Um, that rain is loud. What's this? Nothing. What am I doing? Oh, hell no. All right. Let's go down. Let's do it. Do it for Australia. Jesus. Surprise, O's. It is loud. And uh, uh, hopefully it's not too loud for you guys or girls. Days of thems, dogs, cats, whoever's watching. What is going on? Shift to sprint. Am I like dreaming or something? What is this? Something gonna jump out? Who's this dude? Bleach. Excuse me? I can't select that one apparently. Where did you put it? Where did I put what? Oh, come on, I can't. Where is the bleach? I need the bleach. I don't know what you're talking about, mate. I said the bleach. I don't understand what you're saying. Noah? Noah? Nap time's over. We're here. Oh, it is. He is dreaming, right? We're here. You said you could do this. Wake up now. Wake up, Noah. Wake up. Oh, Noah, wake up. Oh, they tricked me with the old reverse. Noah, wake up. You still think you can do this? I got this, Dad. Roy called and said the keys should be under the fake rock. Got it. He said it's in the backyard. And like I said, keep the doors locked and don't open the door for anyone. Who's the first jump, Dad? Okay, now get your ass to work. I hope you know I'm only in it for the snacks. For space to get out. See you, Dad. Nice moustache. It was a nice neighborhood. Had to get a key from the backyard. What is this? Oh, man. Now, I should note as well that I've actually turned up the brightness in OBS, so it, it should hopefully appear a bit brighter. It is a kind of game that's quite pixelated um, or, or meant to look this kind of old style, so I noticed a lot on time when I was trying to record before it was kind of average looking, so I turned up the brightness a bit. And hopefully, the, like you guys might be able to see a bit better. So if you see someone hiding behind a bloody bush and I can't see it, IRL or in game, bloody shout out and let me know. Why what is why is it so loud? 
Is that a dog? <laughs> He's sleeping. I can pet him. Oh my god. G'day, buddy. How are ya? I'm gonna keep petting ya. He's loving it. He's absolutely loving it. He's not annoyed at all. Ready, boy? Hey, where are you going? Check this out. Yay! Grab it. Grab it. Wait, I gotta look for this key. Hang on. This bloody dog, mate. I wanna go and play with the dog. Um, what exactly am I looking for? Man, it is dark. A rock key. Is this a rock key? There we are. Fake rock key. They were all the rage back in the day, kids, I tell ya. Is this a front door? Good dog, good home. Wait, where did the dog go? There he is. Hey, buddy, what are you doing out here? He's sleeping. Unbelievable. That's a big snore from a little papa. All right, what am I doing? Can I grab a knife already? Maybe not. Can I grab this? I can. What is that? Is that a can opener? Let me just suss out this house first. So, is that where I came in? Wait, where did I come in? There. What's this? Okay. What's this? Toilet. <laughs> Clean it up when you get home, Mr. COO. Got him, boys. Ah, uh, yeah, let's close that. Wash your hands. Can't even. Disgusting. Someone hiding in here? <laughs> Straight away. Imagine that. Text messages. Hello. Wait, can I move this? I can. I remember from my fir very first playthrough I did of Fears of Fathom, I didn't realize you could move this. But then it covered half, like, my cam covered half the, like, conversations. It's gold. Who is this? Wait. What is going on? Hang on, champ. Can you... That message is making me... Anyway. Evelyn Cooper? This school is full of... Hmm. I know, right? But I don't think you're up. Hmm. I don't think you're either. Let me call you in a bit. Pick up. I really wish you could come tonight. Me too. Uh, things you do to keep your old man happy. You know I haven't been... For God's sake, who is it? Roy Carson? It was Ray for a minute. Ray Carson. Ray Bulger. Ray Bulger? I was looking out for Ray Bulger, mate. What a classic line from The Simpsons. If you don't know it, just Google it. Uh, where was I up to? You've been a good kid. If your dad doesn't think you're a good kid, I don't even want to know what mine thinks of me. Roffle. I just think I really disappointed him with Kara. Not again, Noah. You have to stop beating yourself up about it. Jesus, Roy! Chill the flip out, otherwise I'll burn your entire house down. Is that what you want? Never stop beating yourself about it. Wait, did that... Eh, call you again? I just can't help but still feel so stupid. It wasn't your fault. Period. Anyways, you've got some making up to do here. The grudge next weekend, wink wink. 100%, 100%, wink wink. Smiley face, uh, heart. Uh, weird face at heart. I don't know what you kids are texting each other these days. This little baby. A picture of a cat's backside. Great, she's a freak. I'm honestly jealous of Ava Roffle. Is, is Ava the cat? I cur. Just had the weirdest dream ever. All right, now Roy, Ray Bulger, we'll get into you. Thanks for taking up the job, kid. I really appreciate you doing this. I'm sorry I had to leave early. Mr. Carson? My bad, it's Roy. Got this contact from Walter. Work is really getting the best of me here. Oh, no problem, Mr. Carson. My pleasure, really. Ha ha. He's my dad. I wouldn't have asked for anyone if it wasn't for Zeke. Zeke? Boy's been a bit... a little sick lately. Oh, I'll take care of him and the house now that I'm here. You have nothing to worry about, Mr. Carson. You're a lifesaver, kid. Speaking of him, I wanted to remind you it's dinner time. If you could get him his dog food from the basement. By the basement. Right on it, I say. Can I get rid of this... Is that math notebook? Kath's notebook. Get out of here. Oh, never mind. Hang on, wait. Rail was too lazy to model the garage. <laughs> the old dev humor. Why did it make that sound? Or was that just good timing? 
What's this? He's got his own studio going up. What's he filming in here? Don't think I want to know, kids. Let's just move on. Okay, so back here, I've done a full loop. I gotta find the um. I gotta go downstairs. Wait, what's this then? Oh, that's the bathroom. Where's the downstairs? What's through here? Where am I? What is this? Oh, get out of it! <sighs> you know what? Let's just do it, kids. Gotta do it for Australia. Basement was a little too dark. Now, how am I supposed to see in here? There's actually no way. A bloody Ray Bulger's calling me again. Hang on. Almost forgot. I apologize for those lights in the basement. You can grab the flashlight in the storage room upstairs. It's no problem. Don't you bloody do it. I'm getting upstairs. Stop it while you're at it. How do I see those stairs? No. Here. Here. How do I realize this house is way bigger than ours. What do you got in there? Another bathroom? What about in here? Huh? Yep, we won't be going in there just yet. So where's the storeroom? Why did the music stop? Is this the storeroom? Is there any lights or anything in this bloody place? Wait, is that it? F to use. Beauty, got him. Get out! Sorry if that uh, gave you a little bit of a scare, kids. I was just uh, preempting the scare. I'm already lost in this house. Where was it? Here, the basement? Yes. Right? Yes. What am I looking for again? Dog food. Don't do it. What's that? That's dog food. I can't pick it up, you idiot. Oh wait, this one. Oh god. Okay. Yep. Look out! I'm coming. Look out, you mongrels! Let's go, doggo. Had to open the can. Oh my god, of course. Oh, the can opener that I bloody picked up earlier. Jesus. Okay. Okay. I just... I don't know what this game is about. Oh god, I thought someone opened that door. It was bloody me. Um, Where'd I put the can opener? Wasn't it in here? G'day, papa. He was just chilling there. The loudest snoring dog in the world. There you go, boy. I'll just chuck that over there. Get into it, son. There you go. Enjoy. Oh, hang on. Three text messages. Hey, kid. Heard from Walter you're a computer whiz, huh? I have a favor to ask. My computer's been acting weird lately, and my whole security system is tied to it. Oh, yeah. You got a whole security system set up here. Have a lot of expensive equipments laying around. Don't want anything to happen to it. Yeah, I understand. I'll take a look at your computer. Um... Thanks, kid. Alec Carson5387. I'm guessing that's his password. Just send it over text, mate. Nothing sus about that. Can't open it from here. Okay. What's this one? What's this? The laundry kids. Anyone bloody hiding in here, you little mongrels? Hey? What do you reckon? Oops. There you go. What? Oh, no. Oh, okay. At some point in the game, I'm going to have to hide in here, I guess. Or something and not make a noise. Because this is where my infamous... One, so one of the first shorts... Here's a story time, kids. Get comfortable. One of the first videos I ever made was like a short I did. I was playing Fears to Fathom. Uh, Nor Norwood Hitchhike? Northwood Hitchhike? And there's a bit where you had to hide in the cupboard. And the guy came in and like... But you had to hide in the cupboard and if you made any sound, it would trigger this thing. So of course, I at the time have been watching this classic Australian meme which is uh, this guy that got arrested, okay? He here's the uh, succulent Chinese meal story kids that probably people that have watched that video gone like, I don't know what that is. If they somehow manage to find themselves in this video, watching this, God bless them, because here's a story behind it if they don't know. So yeah, basically in Australia, this guy gets pulled out of this restaurant by a bunch of cops. They're putting him under arrest. Now, bear in mind, he'd probably had about 800 drinks. So he's a little bit off with the fairies. But he comes out and he's like, they're like, oh, you're under arrest. He's like, I'm under what? He becomes somehow with the alcohol and the attention he becomes this thespian like speaker and they keep trying to get him in the car and everything and he keeps avoiding and it's classic he manages to shut the door twice it's crazy anyway search it up on youtube succulent chinese meal so anyway they're all trying to arrest him still because he's been eating at this chinese restaurant and the whole backstory is like there's someone's credit card forward whatever 
And anyway, they pull him out of this Chinese restaurant and they're trying to arrest him and he keeps back and forth and stuff. And then he's just like, I'm under arrest for what reason? What's the charge? Eating a meal? A succulent Chinese meal? Even just thinking about it, I'm completely losing my mind. It's one of the funniest things I've ever seen. Anyway, let's get back to it. Bloody hell. How good was that for a nice tangent, kids? Is this his computer? Looks like it. This card's office look like a good spot to sit down and do work. I could sit down and do work. Okay. Space to get up. Wait, can I check out his thing first? I remember I was doing calculus that night. Uh, what was it again? Alec Carson 5387. Guide to... What's this? Guide to being a... Guide to being a better person. Talk and Talk, directed by Alec Carson. In this video, we'll be covering how to talk like a better person. Feel free to take a break whenever needed. What am I watching? Step one, don't be rude. That's fair. Being rude will discourage people from talking to you. What? Eh? Sorry, it appears that something is wrong with the broadcast. In the meantime, enjoy some happy images. He is pretty cute. Step two, remain calm in any conversation. That's loud. Even though what he said was controversial, can you stay calm? The secret of being calm is not let your feelings interfere with the conversation. Like, these are all true points, but not when there's weird crap like this. Being calm makes you a better person. That's all we have for today. Yeah, can I stop this now? That is just weird, you bloody weirdo. I don't know who's doing that. Why am I babysitting this house? Egg. System has encountered a critical error. Okay. BCD burner. Error. Uh, security cams. Error. Internet browser. Free trial for a limited period. Is this going to be... Oh my god. Am I really going to be downloading this? Don't do this, kids. Don't download antivirus or some random weird site that looks as this kind of advertising. Confirm full scan. Confirm full scan. I'm already losing my ability to talk. Jeez, then my voice is breaking. Finally going through puberty, kids. How exciting. Oh, remove. Done. Close. We're now protected. We've done it all. Now I can open egg. No, I can't because I'm missing something. Guess the flag. Oh, we all know this. This is Burundi. See? Oh, this is um, Equatorial Guinea. That was the biggest guess of my life. We all know this is Sweden, mate. Uh, well, it was the same as the last one, but let's try Jamaica. Bad luck. Uh, oh, this is 100% uh, Gambia. Uh, this is Iraq. Evelyn, hang on. I'm trying to pick the flags. That can't be that. Micronesia. Yep, see, I told you. I'm good at Colombia. Um, oh, is this Cameroon? Yep. Okay, what else have we got here? What's that? Uh, Italy, Libya. Uh, yeah, it's this one. I told you. Um, oh, this is Singapore. Uh, this is... What? How many colours is that? It's Mauritius. Um, this one is... This one. There you go. Uh, what do you got here now? Mongolia, Ireland, Guinea, Versa. I think it's Mongolia. See? Close. Um, Costa Rica, Russian Federation. Um, this one is Portugal. And this one is everyone's favourite. Uh, Brunei de Russell or something. Um, this one is... Uh, wait, is it Gambia? Yes. Um, all right, I've had enough of this game. What am I doing? I've got my girlfriend trying to message me. What's this? Oh, no. Oh, I've got night mode as well. <laughs> we got him, boys. I can't move the camera around, right? 
He's still chomping away the little blighter. Look at him go. Or still breathing like a bloody 88 year old bloody man with respiratory issues. Oh god, there's cameras everywhere. I don't like this already. Okay, the camera thing, I've, I've fixed it. I need space to get up. Still messages, right? Did I leave that open? Oh, what was it about? Weird, reminds me of cooking with Jeffrey on Channel 10 last night. By the way, the rerun must be on right now. You gotta watch it with me. Wait, that place got a TV? Haha, <laughs> yeah, hold on. Um, it's done. It was just some Trojan. I recommend you only download softwares from trusted websites. Tell that to my kid, but thanks. I'll drop you a nice tip when I get back. That's the spirit. Wait, so now I've got to go and watch this TV show? Oh, I think I left the... Why is it so loud when it shuts? What's that noise? God, there's someone in here. What is that? I don't know if you can hear that in the audio, but... It's a bloody dog eating! Jesus Christ! Oh, this TV. Car. Evelyn cat Cooper. Food. It's on, are you watching? Hey. Cat food? It's super enjoyable to handle. Doesn't that just look delicious? It's my favorite dish. <laughs> it's raw. Is there someone behind me? Or is that still the dog eating? I keep thinking someone's outside and then it's just a car, I think. Why am I watching a show about someone cooking cat food? Jeffrey really must... Uh, Jeffrey really just be Jeffrey sometimes. He's an idiot, you fool. What am I watching? What am I watching? We dip the cardboard into the milk. Roy. Also, I think... Wait, wait, what did I say? Look at that. Stop. <laughs> also, I think you should get the groceries. Grocerios? Grocerios before it gets too dark outside. There's some cash on my nightstand. Groceries. On it. Oh my god, i got to go get groceries? How do I go get groceries? Space to get up. Can I turn off this abomination? Get off. Um, groceries. Money. Where was the money? Oh, God, I hate these ads. Mr. Cast's bedroom had this weird smell of wet clothes. Where's your cash? Here. Thank you. I'm just running because I don't know what's going to happen. For your trouble, get something for yourself as well. It's on the house. T.Y. Don't do it. You can take Alex's bike. It's outside the garage. What, like here? There's no bike here. Oh my god. Oh, this is pretty wild. Oh, wait, I can't actually. Jesus, hang on. Look at me, kids. It's like the good old days back when your old pal Meaty was riding BMX. The 80s. What a time to be alive. Where am I going? Into the abyss. And they never saw him again, even though he wrote a Reddit article. 9 22 p.m. 9 22 p.m. at the. Don't run into the cars. Jesus, what's going on? Space to get off. 
Huh? Hi. Hey, Chief. You look like the guy I dreamt about. Nothing sus. Hi, you doing good? Doing good, you? Doing good. Use the shopping basket. That's easy enough. Is that this? Thank you. Oh, I've got to get the list. Okay, so ranch, strawberry, jelling, chalk spread for Alex. Chalk spread? Is this ranch? Ranch? What's going on there? Yep. Um. Jelly? Is it meant to be jam? Huh? Easy, love. Uh, what were the other things? Milk and eggs, garden peas and honey. Did I just see honey somewhere? No, I'm tripping. Yeah, here. Garden peas. Would you chill for a second? What are you doing? Wait, hang on. It's gotta be milk here, right? Milk. Then... Eggs. Eggs. Here we go. See, I got this locked down, kids. I got shopping all the time. I'm a bloody expert. So wait, I got... I got honey. Got milk and eggs. Garden peas. Rice. Uncle Tony's. Okay. I think I bought that before. Um, where would the peas be? And this is wheat and pasta and that. Wait, would it be these... Cans, canned peas, baked beans. What are these? Garden peas, that was it, right? Yeah, garden peas. Got it. Wait, I can't. Oh my god. Okay. Ketchup. Don't forget the milk and eggs. Jesus. Okay, where's the ketchup? I'm still crouched. I feel like I walked past the ketchup before, didn't I? Wait, is that the ketchup there? Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Ketchup. Okay, I got it all. It's probably going to fall out, but... What are these two doing? Never mind. Hello! Are you a psychopath that's going to kill me? Never mind, I'll just get out of here. Huh? Jesus, I clicked on her and nothing happened and then she just turned around. Hey son, do you work here? I'm just here shopping. Uh, okay. What is it? My son likes mustard. I came here looking for it, but I can't find it for the life of me. Do you know where it is? Uh, hold on, let me get it for you. Hang on, let me just put this down. Wait, do I want to throw it? I don't want everything to come out. Wait, do I really have to throw these items out? Oh my god, mustard, right? This, you bloody lunatic. The massive thing that says mustard. Doesn't go to glasses. Don't worry, I know how it feels. I have to wear glasses uh, to read and stuff. Uh, G to throw. You. Well, here it is. Give mustard. Thank you, my son. I got an achievement for that. Damn right, I bloody should have got something for it. How is that stuff not falling out? That's what I'd like to know. Oh my gosh, it's in the way. It's going to be like the bloody Simpsons grandpa. I turn it on to three, medium brown. And I'm sitting here waiting all day. Okay, let's go. Should I? Yes, please. Should I bill this for you? Now nah, bill it to the old lady. She'll cover it. Thanks for shopping at Nux. Have a good one. Thanks. Wait a minute, what's the fiber thing? Why, why do I have a fiber thing? Is that because... Is that the thing I treated myself with? It's like, oh man, I can get anything I want at this store. Hey, I've got to stay regular. Better get some fiber cereal. Bloody loser kid. And he's going to go home to do his friggin' math work. After I get him into an accident and he can't walk. I don't know where I'm going. This way? Yeah, let's go down the abandoned creepy street. Back into the void. 9.46 p.m. Okay, we're moving along here, kids. We're moving along real well. Wasted to ride. Oh, God, I can't remember what the place looked like. 
Oh, hang on. Is it on the left or the right? Wait, I had to pee again. Is this the house? I think this is it. Wait, I'll do the right thing and I'll go and put it back where it belongs. What was that? Bloody hate this music, Jesus Christ. Hello? What's that? I can hear someone breathing. Wait a minute, is that the bloody dog again? I kept the groceries in the kitchen. Huh? I thought I'd get through some schoolwork. Let's do this. Let's do some homework. I had to pee first. Jesus, I forgot about peeing. All right, let's go. Yeah, here we go. Beauty. Pee with the door open as well. Like a bloody giga, Chad. What? Hang on, let's move this stuff over here. Dude, you said you're at Carson's, right? You need to see this. Search up Roy Carson divorce on the internet right now. Roy Carson, co-founder of BN Media, allegedly receiving death threats from the angry fans of his ex-wife. Not unusual for the audience to be nosy about some celebrities' personal matters, but sometimes it's just too overbearing. We see something similar in the case of Roy Carson, the COO and co-founder of BN Media. After a very public breakup, yeah, yeah, whatever. Uh, has allegedly been receiving death threats from fans of Alyssa Brown for the rumored infidelity he underwent within the said relationship. Okay, so he cheated and he's getting hate mail. So let's say Roy Carson had people knocking on his door to confront him. Oh, come on. Why is that thing flashing? It's detected someone? Alyssa hasn't been very vocal about the situation yet, but Hunter News is actively trying to reach out to her. So you, the reader, stays updated on the situation. Hang on, Chief. Dog's not scared. I have to go down there and do it. It won't let me do anything else, right? Stop. Because you never know with these ones, like who's... Because last time it's like I couldn't progress unless I answered the door. So I have to... Who is it? Your delivery for your one medium size from Pizza Depot, sir. What delivery? You want me in pepperoni? You must be at the wrong... This is Sudivabura, right? That's correct. It's ordered by the name of... Um... Roy Carson? You bloody idiot! Take! All right, thanks, mate. Have a good night. No, I said have a good night. Uh, this is probably a very strange request, but... Do you think I can wait inside until the rain's over? Probably not very safe to be out here right now, and I forgot my raincoat at the shop. What do you mean? Your car's over there, you idiot. This is not my house. Oh, jeez. I'm not sure my dad would like that. He's upstairs. Yep. It's perfectly in line with my previous few episodes I played, well, the very first one I played, and you're in that house. And I gotta say, Dad, get the shotgun to make the, I used to say it as a kid with my mate, to scare off any potential intruders. So, yep, yep, I understand. Well, you have a good day. Thanks. Get out. It's like, oh, can I come in? It's raining. And then he just gets in his car and drives off. He's fine. What am I doing with this? Do I watch TV? Huh? Ah. 
Look out for some pizzas. It should arrive any minute. Enjoy. You Thanks for telling me, mate. Like, I appreciate it, but Jesus. Okay. Ah! Oh, there was someone bloody talking to me. Thought I could watch some TV while eating. Okay, cool. Space to get up. Jack. Jeez, look at that. What? Are you doing your work? You'll have to spend the night in the dungeon kingdom. It's a dominant yet the leaders of two swords. I can't see the stairs now. My name is Jack Barnett. I have been held hostage by Mr. Holland for 37 days. He makes me solve math work until my head hurts. What am I watching? I escape. Can I use the bathroom? This is a very weird thing to be watching. Hope everything's okay. Wait, what's she even saying? What are you doing? Good night, now I hope everything's good. Sorry, I got caught up with work. Good night, Eve. Sweet dreams. He's a bloody cat, I tell ya. So what do I know so far? So this guy was getting harassed by, like, fans? Is this what it's gonna be? That this guy's getting bloody... I heard someone at the door again. I've had enough of you. Someone knocked at the door. You know what I say about that? Wait, is it a trick to get me upstairs? I knew I heard a knock at the door. Don't do it. Never mind. Check the bloody cameras. Think I'm gonna go out there? You bloody thought wrong, you idiots. Okay. Not in the basement. Not in that room. Not upstairs, thank God. Dog's still chilling. Backyard looks okay. Who was that? She went around the back. Didn't she? Where's she gone? Was it a girl? It looked like a girl. What is that on the... I just wanted to do my calculus. I still don't know if it's a her. It just looked like a girl. It looked kind of like the bloody... Who's the girl? Resident Evil 3? Yeah, you can tell I'm starting to talk more now, don't you, kids? Hey? You know what that means, that's right. That I'm bloody nervous and crazy and whatever. Who's out there? What was I doing again? Was I going to open this door? Am I crazy? Who is it? I didn't know what to make of it. Flowers, mate. What do you mean? What do you want with it? So what am I doing now? Going back up to do calculus? This dude just like, oh, I saw some creepy person in the rain walking around the back of my house, leaving flowers at my door. Oh, but I decided, like, I'd just continue doing calculus. Hey, how are you? What did you have for dinner? Eh. I had pizza. It was strange, but I dismissed the thought as a weird coincidence and moved on. Uh -huh. Besides, I had a lot of work to catch up on. You're right. We got to do our schoolwork. Let's not worry about the potential uh, serial killer outside. We'll just we'll just keep doing our schoolwork. Engrossment. Boy loves his calculus. You're not going to keep him from it. Not even on a. Uh, Paid, but I don't even know what this bloody place is. That's Zeke. 
While I was in the middle of my schoolwork, the power went off. Like, what? Five unread messages? Hang on. Are you by yourself? Why do you keep ignoring me? Why are you always so mean to me? You're being very immature right now. Fine, if you're going to be like that, I don't need you anyways. Todd is so much hotter anyways. Yeah, who are you? What does it want me to do? In that moment, I was almost certain it had to be another prank. What is that sound? Why is my torch just floating there? Saying it detected movement. Oh, Jesus, not in here, please. I'm almost too scared to go to the next bloody screen. There's the flowers. I swear to God, Zeke better bloody be there. Or else. Where's Zeke? I'm sure I just saw someone in that bottom right corner, right? That's Zeke? Oh, Jesus. All right, kids. Game time's over. Now it's starting to get creepy. Please, I never know, because it's always like a choice where if you do one thing and then that's what, that's what gets them. Ah, see the crouch. Zeke is going absolutely bananas. You better not have done anything to Zeke, I swear to God. The dog is going crazy. Is he out here? I swear to God. You better leave that dog alone. You better leave my favorite dog, Zeke, alone, I swear to God. Yep, I'm just going to go out. What you got, boys? It's suddenly very cold outside. Wait, is that where she walked? He, she, it, or is it back here? Don't! I can hear Zeke, but I can't see him. Where is he? Zeke! What's going on, boy? Zeke was acting very weird. Thank God you're still alive, Jesus Christ. That would have been an absolute tragedy. What's this? Is this meant to be the power? Was I meant to do that? I turned the power back on. I could tell that someone cut the power off from outside. Jesus. Where's Zeke going? Zeke? Oh, does he want to be let in? What are you barking at? I'll pat him. Zeke was acting very weird. Huh? What are you doing, Zeke? Yeah, I'm kind of freaking out now. Zeke? Where is he going? To the bike? Zeke? He just walked through there. I can't go through there, Zeke. Zeke literally just morphed through a goddamn fence. You said we'd stay friends. Turner, this is not funny. I know it's you. What was that? I heard someone. I had to get back to my schoolwork for Monday. Didn't I just hear someone up here? Is 
that Zeke snoring again? Gotta get back to my schoolwork, okay. Grossman again. Bloody Zeke. I had a strange gut feeling about the situation. Might sound stupid, but I just didn't want to overthink things. Okay, fair enough. What am I doing? Am I doing more work? Wait. Check the cameras. The cams. It's flashing again. Were those lights knocked over before? Huh? No one in the basement. No one in that room, whatever it is. None in the hall. Zeke snoring somewhere. Yeah, apart from that stuff knocked over, I think we're good. So am I just going back to my work? Again, I'm doing more more calculus. I heard something downstairs. Oh, hell no. The bloody cameras are going off again. Wait. I could swear in my life I didn't turn that oven on. Oh, God. The oven's on. Wait, did I turn it on before? No, why would it say that in the game? How would it know I did that? Okay, I can't see anything through here. All right. You know what time it is, that's right. Did I not hear like a knife sheathing? Like, is there someone here? I had to go down and check. Please don't kill me. Zeke, wake up, you stupid mongrel. You're supposed to be protecting me. Huh? Don't do it. Oven's off. Good on you, Zeke. You're doing God's work out there. Like here, maybe very un uncomfortable knowing he was in the house. Oh, is it a he? Oh my god, it's a he. I had to confront him. I didn't have his contact. I could only ask Andy. Can you send me Turner's contact? Ask him to quit messing? Come on, give me the contact. I'm not moving until I'm done. He's messing with what? He's been snooping around the house. This is not cool. Question mark. Dude, he's at my place right now. Uh-oh. We were going to go to the movies with Brady, but then it started pouring and we got stuck in the sleepover. That music is like bloody pins and needles up my spine. I attribute all of that to the lack of my sleep. I was aware I have a tendency of being overly paranoid. Oh, that's a Zeke. The only logical thing is at the time was to keep an eye on the security monitor. Jesus. Now I think about it, I should have called the cops. You reckon, buddy? The idea never entered my head. What idea? Stop. Zeke, mate, why can I hear you? No one would have heard that loud door slam. Well done. Get up. Uh-huh. 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 Uh-huh.
Well, there's nothing, so what what am I going to do? I swear that wasn't like that before. Did I open that? Andy, hang on. I'm about to be bloody killed. Dude, wait, did you check out that article? It was Brady who told me about it. Oh, this is real sketchy. Someone in the room with me? I felt my heart skip a beat. I froze and kept staring at the screen in pure horror. Please don't come here. Please don't come here. What am I supposed to do? Just wait until she kills me? I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. She was right outside the door to the room I was in. Thought my heart would pound right off my chest. Did she just say Noah? Are you in there? I really missed you. What do I do? Oh my god, kids, I don't know what to do. If I just... I'm just doing, I accidentally clicked that. Don't play dumb with me, Noah. I know you're in there. Open the door. We just need to talk. I've always been nothing but nice to you. You always treated me like... I don't want to talk. I'm out of here, boys. Noise, right? Um. Dad, get the shotgun. I know everything. I know you left me for her. Oh, wait, did I, I had to continue the conversation? At least she is not a junk attack. No, let's not piss her off anymore. Uh, this is exactly why. It's different with her, but I love you. What about that? You need to leave right now. We. Okay, okay, okay. You know, I could turn into the police for this, and then she stopped. She stopped. Do, and I will effing kill both of you. Yep, we're done. We're done. Why is that music like that? If I can't have you, no one else should. Noah. Yes. Hello? No! 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 Zeke! 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 
Wake up, you stupid dog. I'm being bloody chased. Jesus Christ, Zeke. Zeke, Zeke, you need to get up right now and bloody get to me, you little mongrel. This is the longest cut. Am I getting away from her? Zeke. Zeke. Wake up, you stupid. Where's he gone? Oh, the dog's even fled. Jesus Christ. Okay, kids, we're back here. That was a fun little scare, wasn't it? Jesus, thanks for nothing, Zeke. All right. So, I don't go... Do I just stay quiet? I don't exit. I guess I just need to get... What do you want? How did you get in here? I've always been nothing but nice to you. Yep. I know everything. I know you left me for her. It's different with her. Yep, okay. But I love you. What about that? You need to leave right now. We deserve a second chance. Jesus, come on. You know I can turn you into the police for this. Nothing, nothing. Do it and I will effing kill you both. Face to get up. If I can't have you. No one else should. Why does that have to wait? Not the flashlight, you idiot. Zeke, you better bloody wake up, buddy. We got some... Oh, thank God. I left the house, ran down the block. My dad called the cops. Though so by the time they arrived, she already left the house. But I knew where she lived. Tara was one of the first people I met on a dating site. She was three years older than me, but I found her cute and we started dating. However, two months into our relationship, she started doing hard drugs. I tried to get her help, but she turned it around on me as if I was trying to change her. One day I had enough and I had to break up with her. I told her to leave and never contact me again. She was pissed. She was trying to convince one of the She was trying to convince one of the cops she didn't intend on doing anything wrong that night, but of course the cop wasn't buying it. The review They reviewed the footage and showed everything, from the point of her entry to the moment she grabbed the kitchen knife. But the thing that messed with me the most was the fact that nothing was stolen from the house. Turns out she was heavily under the influence of the drug and alcohol at the time. She was arrested and sentenced for a long while. And of course, while all this is going on, good old Zeke was sound asleep.